we're diving into a pretty significant upgrade for my battle axe setup. So considering my playstyle and build, I've been giving some serious thought to whether Miskaller might just be the perfect offhand choice for me, and I've got some reasons to back that up. Also, shout out to all my viewers asking me to try out the Miskaller. First off, the Miskaller has some impressive cooldown reduction, which basically means I can use my E ability more often or opt for different food that will boost my damage output. In the past, when I was rolling with a torch, my cooldown reduction wasn't as uh, snappy, so I had to rely on eel stew but now i can switch things up and go for something like beef stew to dish out some serious damage of course old habits die hard so i might still keep eel stew in my rotation just because i love spamming those e's and having shorter cooldowns on my other abilities now speaking of torches they do offer an attack speed bonus which can be super handy if you're in the thick of things brawling it out and using your second w ability a lot but the thing is my style is more about hitting hard and stepping back by using my invis or mobility than doing it all over again. Anyway, the reason I'm giving this Miss Cholera a shot is even though it's a bit pricier compared to a torch, is because I've got a stash of ruins, souls, and relics saved up, which means I can grab a 4.0 or 5.0 Miss Cholera and easily boost it up to 4.3 or 5.2, and it's gonna cost me less than buying an enchanted torch. In this video, you'll mostly see me rocking a 5.2 or a 4.3 Miss Color, and we're gonna see how, just how much of a game changer the switch is compared to the torch. Now let's get into it. Okay, we're gonna fight this carving sword. I think he's around 7.2. We're gonna team up with the crossbow and kill him, hopefully. If we kill him, we should get around like 2 million, I think. We're gonna... Wait for our cooldowns and then try to Q into E. We can sprint and then Q. Now E. We gotta Q again. We can W now. Gotta wait 10 seconds for sprint. The crossbow should be able to slow him down with his Q, I think. Yeah. I think he's gonna die. We, got, we can axe him again. Yeah, he's almost dead. Yeah. Yeah, I killed him. I got the kill. He stole my loot, so we're gonna kill him. He's almost dead. We're gonna Q and then E. And then he should die. Oh, I had a cooldown there. The sword might kill him. And we're gonna kill him as well. Cause he took the kill so I can't loot. We're gonna kill him and then loot him after. Oh, I shouldn't have missed my E there. But he's basically dead. You can just Q. Oh, he's dead. Nothing. 5.1. Let's, oh, let's kill this guy too. He's trying to take the loot. The 7.2's loot is right there. We're gonna invis and then fight this guy. Should be able to easily kill him. You can E. You gotta get away from his helion jacket. So he can't heal up. Now you can E him again. Okay. And we're gonna f W, Q, and then kill him. And he's dead. Oh, 200k, not bad. This guy had 2.4 million. Damn. We got lucky there. Okay, we're gonna fight with these guys. It's a DBS and uh, Ava gloves. We're gonna kill the Ava Gloves, he's like high IP. So everyone's gonna gang up on him. Hopefully kill him, he's almost dead. Gotta eat him one, one more, yeah he's dead. I'm um, a million. Okay so I was doing this miss camp and then this quarter staff tried to rat me. So we're gonna fight him. Let's get an E here, 
Okay, got him with the E. He missed his E. We're gonna pop the Hunter Hood. He popped his Cultist Cowl so we can't do anything. Okay, we're gonna get away from his Stalker Jacket. He's gonna run now so we gotta wait for our cooldown. Five seconds for the sprint. Okay, yeah, he's trying to run away now. See if we can finish him off. Oh, he popped his Cultist Cow. It's gonna be close. We're gonna pop our Hunter Hood and see if he can kill himself. He missed our W. Okay, yeah, he killed himself. Perfect. A million. Okay, so this spear is chasing us. We have the wisp. We're gonna dismount that guy, see if he can fight the spear with us. Okay, so the, sp the spear is running away. Let's see if you can finish him off. We gotta wait for a cooldown on the axe. He got me with this E. Oh, and he got me with the stalker jacket. You can run away from most of that though. We healed up with the E as well. Gotta wait the cooldown now. Gotta wait for our W cooldown. Yeah, he's gonna run now, but he has around the same mobility as at a, as us. Okay, so I stopped him from using his cabbage stew, which is good, so he can't heal. Let's see if we can catch him here. I'm gonna wait 5 seconds and then W and then Q, E. Okay, yeah, I think he's... Oh, we missed our E there. He wasted his hunter hood though. We can sprint and finish him off, hopefully. Yeah, he's dead. Only 140. There's a 5.2 Kristaff. We're gonna fight him. He got us with this W. He tried to E me for some reason. Don't know what he was doing there. Curse is pretty easy. You just kite them a bit and then finish, finish them off. Don't let them get their E or 3 stack E. When they try Eing you, just invis and re engage. Miss the W and the E there. We're gonna get some damage here. And Q and E again. W, Q, E. I shouldn't have went for the double E. We're gonna pop our Hunter Hood and get some of that damage off. And now we just gotta finish him off. Get an E there. You just gotta Q him once more. Should be dead. So yeah, Kristaffs aren't really that hard. Oh, I missed that E there. Shouldn't have missed that E, but the Q kills. Let's see how much he had. 300k, not bad. Okay, there, there's a, a tier 8 Bow of Adon. He's gonna dismount us, and now we're gonna kill him. Get E there. Yeah, he's half health already. Basically dead. Get some damage there. Sprint and then we can we use our E for no reason there, but he's basically dead. You can W and finish him off. He's gonna invis potion. He might get away. Okay, he's over there. Yeah, he's dead. We can sprint and then finish him off. 
I gotta wait for our W. We can W and then... Or just reflect him with the Hunter Herd. Now he's dead. Pretty good, 700k. The Spider had 500k. Let's try to rat these guys. It's a spear and a carving sword. We'll kill whoever is low enough. We can W then sprint. They're, really, they're low health so... Let's kill this guy. Yeah, he's dead. He's got a W. Yup, he's dead. Okay, we gotta get away from this carving sword. Try to rat us. We can invis and then just sprint and get away from him. Yeah, we should be able to escape. Just gonna mount up now. We're gonna fight this fire staff. He has a wisp. He's low IP, I think, so it shouldn't be that hard. You just gotta E him and then reflect his damage. They can kill, these guys can kill you fast, so you gotta reflect at the perfect time. Let's get an E here. You can't E, run away. I'm gonna de aggro the mobs and then go after him. Got him with the E there. He's at 1500 health, so we could engage him. And then once he starts hitting me, we could Hunter Hood. Oh, he missed his E there. We're gonna Hunter Hood and then E. I missed my E again. This firewall thing is annoying. We can invis as well. He missed the E again. He missed his E, which is big. Let's see if we can E him. He missed the E again. He missed three E's in a row, so he had to invis there. Okay, we're gonna engage him one more time and see if we can kill him. He's gonna E me, so we're gonna have to block that. Let's pop our hunter hood. He missed his E. We're gonna E him again. He's dead. Let's go. 200k. 